Patricia Resto. Here with Top Rank's very own Bob Arum. Bob, we have this huge unification fight, Morris Hooker and Jose Ramirez. How easy or how difficult was it to put this fight together? Well, very easy. Once both fighters want a particular fight, it's easy to put together. This is a great fight for Jose Ramirez. He's been wanting these big fights. He's wanted to unify titles. What do you expect to see from him tomorrow night? Well, I think he's going to be in great shape. Uh, he has a great game plan. He's worked very good with a tremendous trainer, uh, Robert Garcia. And uh, so we look for the best uh, that you've seen of uh, Jose Ramirez. Uh, Hooker's a really terrific fighter. So it should be a tremendous fight. It's great to see promotional companies working together to bring us great fights. Another one that was recently announced was with Lomachenko with uh, Luke Campbell over in the UK. What are you expecting to see from that mega unification as well? One winner, right? <laughs> Lomachenko. Nobody's going to beat him at lightweight. Do you, feel, do you feel like he's going to jump up to the, to the super? No, he's, yeah. he's a small guy. He's mostly, he should be fighting featherweight, but there's no competition there for him. So you think why, did, the, uh, why did you find it important to have that fight in the UK? Because uh, Loma uh, has visited the UK, he won one of his gold medals in the UK, and he's always wanted to fight there. They're great fans in the UK. Uh, you know, he's fought all of his fights uh, except one in Macau uh, in the United States. So now we're going to move him around around the world. I mean, you know, he's such a talent. People should have the opportunity to see him in person. Was it hard to convince him? Speak, I'm doing that excuse, I'm sorry. Um, Speaking of talent, someone that you know very well, who's talented as well, who showed um, a rejuvenated, rejuvenated talent was Manny Pacquiao this weekend. Did you happen to catch his fight? Yes, I thought he looked very, very good, but he's 40 years old, and when you get up in that age, you can't keep taking punches to the head without it affecting you as you get old. I mean, I'm, I really, really, really um, I'm worried. Uh, as far as Manny is concerned. Yeah, I know he showed great with Thurman, but he took a lot of punches. And when you're that age, it's very, very dangerous. I know that he, he looked good, but like you mentioned, he did take a lot of punishment, um, especially towards the end of the, of the fight. And a lot of people are saying that he should just go out in glory now. If, I Particularly know he, if he wants to be president of his country. Yeah. He can't be president of his country and have boxing syndrome where he can't talk. Yeah. So obviously he's going to do whatever he wants. Yeah, right. All right, enough. All right, yeah. <laughs>